What's going on, y'all? I got <clears throat> all my speed run cars. Well, five of my speed run cars up. I saw somebody post about them drilling the uh, A arms, which I did to one of my Typhons. I did to one of my Limitlesses. And this Limitless, I mean, this Typhon that uh, I picked up from the guy that started me in speed runs, uh, he showed me how to do them. He does them to all his. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my drill and show you all where to drill at which is not hard to find the drip screws are underneath I don't know if you can see that and we should be able to that's a drip screw so basically you need to make a hole right about there and just go slowly oh gotta go the wrong way make sure you're going the right way just right in that corner just make it nice little hole Get that out of there. That's one hole. Then another one. Make right around the same spot. And you just go for it. Just to let you know. It's a five millimeter drill bit that I'm using. This is on my uh Limitless with the XLX2. It is the used uh, chassis Limitless that I had. Uh, I'm going to do it to the felony also because I'm going to end up getting this set up correctly for uh, speed runs also. And a little bit of drag. I don't bash too much. So you can see down there, droop screw. That's the droop screw right there. I got to clean my cars. Brand new felony. Right there in the little corner right there. Oh, wrong way. Right there in the corner. About, about there. Yeah, make sure you get in the right spot. <laughs> That's another one. So basically what I have to do after this doing all these holes or just these two holes on each car I'm gonna have to go and set my toe and all that good stuff so I can go and get the best traction for tires that I can right through those holes will be the droop, school, droop screws as you can see through the one on the right, that's the drip screw right there. And the one on the left, there's the drip screw right there. All right, y'all. That's how you do it. Don't be scared. And that's it. I'll be doing other videos on how to set the suspension and all that stuff down uh, soon enough. So y'all keep it locked for all that good stuff. All right, y'all, on to the um, Limitless after drilling the holes. I'm sure I don't need to tell y'all that you need a 2.0 millimeter <coughs> hex to go in there and to adjust your droop screws that way. And I right, did that, got the suspension down, got everything level to where I like it. Scraping the damn ground, pretty much. Get myself a little angle. Yeah, she's a little dirty. I took her out. All my cars are dirty. I need to give them all bass. <clears throat> um, yeah. Um, the other thing that I do, because I don't have a leveling kit or a camber kit or whatever, um, I pretty much take a card and try to get it as flush as possible. Um, shout out to Bay Area. That was my hobby shop in Maryland. But anyways, that's, uh, that is how I get my level on to you know the camber that's how i get my camber straight by doing that checking it that way and adjusting everything back of the arms and then you know all the stuff that you got to do for speed running if you don't know well there's other people that got some other ways that they do all their stuff but um that's how i do mine haven't had no problems with anything but um 
Next thing for this is I have to get a cover, but I'm going to take a cover off in another one of my cars, uh, Blitz, and put it on here. And I'm going to get some new wheels, which I have sitting back there. I just don't know which ones I want to put on here yet. Because it's a different kind of setup. This is uh, drag. I got some BSRs back there. I have to see what, um, what kind they are because I know they're purples. I think purples are for... Um, top speed runs i've never had no bsrs before so let me get those real quick all right y'all here they are uh bsrs foam tires team purples like i said i never ran these before all i ran were a grp s3s s4s s5s s7s that's all i've ever ran the traded ones and the slicks heard these are a whole brand new ball game it's like running off skates so I'm going to give it a try on low gearing. I have a low gearing. The guy I bought this from, um, he had took the spool out, I guess, and put a diff from like a Creighton or something. But I have a spool over here, which I'm going to, you know, get that put on later, later date. That one's for the felony when I, after I start doing test runs for that. But, um, yeah, I got a lot of stuff going on. Uh, if anybody's ran on these and have time to respond to me at all, um, let me know how it is running on these. Like, I, I guess this is going to turn into a how is BSR films run compared to uh, GRPs. Um, I heard they're t totally different. So, all right. I'm going to get these on real quick. off now time to open up some BSRs BSR purpose. these things are wide much bigger than the I mean so I can tell just by opening up the box let's look at these jeez Look at the size difference. All the way around. All the way around. Somewhat. Definitely bigger. Uh, let's get these on here. Alright, Joe, we're about to fit on the last uh, BSR. Then I'm going to tighten them down and give them a little look-see. Um, not going to run them today because I actually want to get some feedback from some people. I've got like three people's feedback. And they all said uh, basically what I said. It's way different from GRPs. And that's what it looks like right now. All white looks pretty good. Never would have picked the all white, but they're hard to find right now, and I couldn't pass up the price for them. So, yeah, 